<laughs> Good luck. <laughs> Um, I would like to say a few words, just to be annoying, because I know you want prizes. Um, I would just like to give a huge thank you to, to everybody that gets involved with Cadet Week. Uh, Cadet Week is a huge undertaking from, uh, from very early on in the year. Uh, everything gets arranged via our committees. Uh, there's lots of committees, there's lots of stuff going on in the background, boats getting repaired. Boats getting in the water, res rescue boats, safety, food, boats and tap, everything that goes in the cadet week. Um, Mark took on the, uh, the, uh, the chambers this time and he's, uh, he's actually managed to come pull through, I think, with a rather good week. But we'll come back to him in a minute. You guys have got involved with uh, with the Yacht Club, uh, with Cadet Week. Um, one thing about Thorpe Bay Yacht Club is that it's a huge spirit in, in the, amount, the amount of people that help here. Um, and it's always good, and the opportunity comes, if the opportunity arises for you to offer to help, then it would be lovely to see more people on the committees of the club running all the events we do, uh, like this year we did the Fever event, which was a huge success, uh, and Cadet Week, which is another huge success. So to all those that help already, a huge thank you from the club uh, and all those that are waiting to help then please do come forward when your time when the time comes towards the end of the year when committees are formed and, and decisions are made um, moving on from that um, there are a couple of huge thank yous um, that can't be ignored uh, the first is our sponsors uh, without which uh, we would um, wouldn't be able to run the way the week the way we do and certainly all these lovely prizes at the end and various other things that are given during the week. I'd just like to single out one sponsor in, in particular, which is Peter Thompson, if he's here. Because he, uh, he not only gave, uh, he not only sponsored the event, but he gave us lots of prizes for the event. And as you're aware, the Stingray Group enjoyed the use of some rather lovely uh, floating paddle boards. Uh, so thank you very much, Peter. The spirit, uh, the spirit of Thorby Yacht Club lives on and has lived on for a long time. Uh, the one person I'd like to thank as well, which is somebody who comes back year on year uh, and puts her name forward for absolutely everything to do with helping out in the Bosun's Hut, and that's Barbara Hervé. I'd like to thank her very much. It would be lovely to see some of these kids, some of you guys, out on the water now. We've, we've, you now know how to sail. A lot of you know how to sail very well. Uh, it would be nice of you to get uh, involved with club racing. We've got the Thorpe Bay Regatta coming up at the end of this month, um, of which there'll be a special cadet prize. Uh, so it would be nice to see some of the, uh, the older ones, the Fevers and the Picos, uh, taking part in that. Um, and as I say, that is at the end of the month. There's, uh, there's quite a lot going on. Three days of racing, disco and barbecue. Where's Jeremy? Is that now? <laughs> Right, so uh, yes, that's the uh, thought we're going to that's our next big event, okay? So, um, 
The only thing I need to do now is to hand you over to somebody who um, put his name forward and wants to run it for another five years. Um, <laughs> Uh, there was a collection earlier, and, uh, and part of that collection, and part of the uh, part of the week is a huge thank you to Mark. Uh, there's a voucher in here for um, one pound. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> we went through out of the voucher, two hundred and fifty pounds for you, sir, as a collection. Thank you very much. Yay. Towards Mark, I'm sure he doesn't deserve it, but it means he'll do it again next year at least. So uh, I'll pass you all over. Thank you very much. You've been a wonderful kids, it's been a wonderful week, it's been absolutely lovely, lovely to see, lovely to be part of, uh, and I'm, I'm sure you'll all agree that it's been a wonderful week. Thank you all very much, and uh, I'll hand you over to Mark. Well, thank you very much. Um, pretty gobsmacked. Thank you very much for that collection and the lovely. Uh, bottle of champagne. <laughs> right, um, really it's all about the kids really isn't it, Cadet Week, um, and all the volunteers, I want a huge thank you uh, throughout the board to all the groups, and uh, don't sit on that Nick, <laughs> that's only rated to 20 stone. So. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, keep away from that voucher. Yeah, as Nick said, I can only uh, thank the sponsors and I'm going to go through them very, very quickly. Um, without my glasses on. Uh, so it's RDP Newman's, uh, they sponsored the shirts, uh, the lovely shirts you've got on there, so well done. Colin <laughs> from Miranda Insurance, who will be presenting the prize tonight, he's in the corner there. Uh, Pete Thompson from Maxwell Outlet, uh, every year. Jerry Bell of Hairdressers. Harrison Holgate. Uh, Johnson Gillies Limited. Robinson Solicitors, Fated Chip, Pearl Dragon Restaurant, and Stephen Brown. So thank you and good thank you for As Nick said, that allows us to keep the prices down and invest in some new equipment for all the uh, uh, various sections within the club, uh, especially the cadet section. Okay. Uh, I'd like to thank the cadet committee of, uh, well there's a few standing up here, Mike Thomason is an unsung hero, really uncomfortable with praise, but I don't care. He's the real driving force behind Cadet Week, as most, most of us know. Oh, hello. As most of us know. Um, Debbie Kilkelly, she's here as well. Um, she's you know, sunning herself on holiday, she's left us. But uh, again, um, a massive driver. Uh, Scott Weller, uh, Tim Allard, and Matt Waters. Okay, uh, I'd like to thank all the bar staff as well. They've done a fantastic job uh, behind keeping the store open. Also, I'm not reading this, by the way. Uh, <laughs> the caterers, very uh, big round of applause for Richard and Lisa and all the crew and Lewis. And Maggie, thank you very much for feeding us. All the support uh, boat crews as well, um, people that have volunteered uh, yeah, and sun themselves and get a great turn out there. Uh, must have been awful this week. So thank, thank, you. <laughs> thank you very much for that. Um, A couple of prizes I'd like to give out to Toby and Tony, if they're about. Uh, they're, uh, Toby's in charge of all the displacement craft. As Barry Juice once said, we just turn up, we turn the key and off we go. There's a lot of work that go in to get them uh, to that stage. <laughs> is, is, is there a mic? Right. Um, so, uh, would Tony and Toby like to, uh, to come up here once again, every year, day and day. Thank you. 
Um, everyone who volunteered on the road to downstairs, um, you've all stepped up to the plate, and so thank you for volunteering for all your rotors and for turning up as well. So it really makes my job a lot easier. Thank you very much. One person that has been mentioned um, to, tonight by Nick is um, Barbara, Barbara Hervey. She's um, really stepped up to the plate when I needed her. Um, and she's also um, raised £66 for the RNA for um, donating um, for teas and coffees in that little modern magazine. So well done, Barbara. Is she here? Doesn't fit to fit. So uh, we'll. Well, it, 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 go over here. All oh, right, okay. I can't read my notes now, though. Sorry, sorry, guys. I'm not used to this. Right. Turn the page, I've got to turn the page, yeah. <laughs> keep with me, keep with me. Okay, um, that's everyone. I hope I haven't um, forgotten anyone. I have forgotten Lindsay Swindon, who is what I was going to say. So, big hand for Lindsay. <laughs> Brilliant. Thank you very much. Uh, Lindsay will be producing the DVD, so if you want to order one, please do. £10 profits going to uh, the, uh, the Thought Bay Yacht Club. Okay. Thank you very much. Okay, um, right, let's go to the Stingray group now. Um, yeah, oh, oh. That's much better over here, actually. Um, yeah, we did some sailing relays, treasure hunts, uh, paddleboard races with the lovely uh, paddleboards that Peter provided. Some stingrays, uh, was in barracudas, and came back down to piranhas, who in previous years we couldn't get in a boat. But he's worked up, built his confidence up, and this week couldn't keep him out of the boat. He was first on every start line that we practice. And he then won the race. So this year is Mason Swindon. person I'd, I'd like to thank the, this week who uh, every night whenever we put all the boats away she would walk around the boat park she would check if there any, any boats on the beach she would check and put them all away properly a uh, lovely little girl and a, just a little hat and some chocolates to uh, what was her name yeah. <laughs> I'm only joking <laughs> Ruby Slack where is she what well happened I just uh, would really like to thank Mark and Mike because I'm quite new to this. They really are very supportive to me throughout the Cadet Week, give me lots of advice. So please, thank you, Mark, thank you, Mike, and thank you, kids. We're going to do a great way. And hopefully, I'll see you next year. Bravo, Scotland! Big hand for Scott Weller. He's in the house. Well done, well done, Scott. Thank you very much. Um, okay. From each group, uh, team leader and helpers. So everyone uh, who's nominated will receive a prize. So in yellow team, Elizabeth Blower, would you like to come up, please? James Stobarts. Well nice glasses. Uh, 
in black team, Isla Higginson. In blue team, Antonia Burrows. Antonia. Antonia has never started before. Can I shake your hand? Well done. Excellent. And in red team, an overall winner of the most improved Stingray Trophy, which I'd like to uh, present to Colin from Miranda Insurance to present, and that's what they get, is it's becoming a bit of a habit in this family. It was Rosa last year, and it's now Lily Collis this year. So it's Lily Collis. Well done. Lily, there you go. There's, there's more prizes for you. So well done. A star, well, all stars of the future. So big hands. Okay, um, that's the Stingray prize giving for this year. I hope you've all had a great time. I'm going to move over here again. Oh, sorry. Um, would, um, <laughs> would Jeremy like to come up and pick his Le Mans trophy up, please? Or can you pass it in? Can you it? Oh, no, it wasn't Jeremy. It was Mark Evans, wasn't it? Yeah, where is Mark Evans? Sorry, Jeremy. You can sit down now. Sorry, my mistake. I'm used to uh, giving it to Jeremy. Speak, speak. Speak, speak. Um, just, uh, I'd like to say, again, just to reiterate what Mark said, really, thank you for everyone that's turned up and helped out. Thanks to all the team leaders. Um, a couple of them helped me today in the paddle race, especially John there. I've had legs a few times. Um, no, it's been a great week. Um, thanks to everyone that's turned up, everyone that's got involved. And a real thanks to again Mark, who again has organised a very good week. And, uh, yeah, thank you. Right, so thank you again, Stingroach. Thanks to everyone. Um, I'll, I'll get off the uh, boat now and hand you over to the chap who's itching to uh, speak to you now. It's the Piranha Leader, Mr. Scott Brown. So thank you very much. Okay. <laughs> thank you, Mark. Thank you, Steve Rays. Okay. Right. This won't take long, I promise. It looks a lot, but it won't take long, I promise. Okay guys, uh, now, 
Gin of Wheat, like all the other groups, we do have the most improved. And this is always a toughie. Uh, there are people who do stand out more than others. And at the end of the day, I actually did it mathematically. I actually worked out the weighted average, so I'm telling you boring, but the weighted average of the first day's points to the last day's points. And we actually had two ladies' teams very, very close together, and it was very, very hard. And so this year we've actually got like a runners-up most improved, which I would really like to give. And it does give me enormous pleasure to give this to uh, Miranda and Rose, if you'd like to come forward. This week we've had a fantastic week of water. We've had 20 races, and that's 20 points races, probably more than the uh, race group. I think uh, at the beginning of the week, uh, several of 